What's up legions welcome to another video it looks like we have another legion update for Friday and we're going to break that down this video so if that's something you guys were interested in make sure you hit the like button subscribe to this channel let's get right into it as you can see here he's confirmed that we did get a legion space update and here he states what's to come for legion space in the near future so let's break that down here key customization key mapping is high priority use left and right triggers for mouse clicks above implementation will allow this Taskbar system tray minimization of space, additional customization option for space, driver bias firmware update incorporated into Legion space, eliminating the need to rely on the manual alternative update path. This is something that I'm really excited about. DPI settings for trackpad and FPS mode, FPS limited, which include based on the feedback from last update. 30, 36, 48, 60, 72 and custom, adjustable fan curve in space, ability to turn off light and power button, desktop mode are similar, adjust automatic sleep timing on controllers, LT, RT, dead zone, activation point adjustment, ability to hide games in space, rapid charge battery conservation toggle, and again it states that the next Legion Space update is planned for January, so this is pretty exciting to see more stuff coming to Legion Space. So onto other things, FSR 3.0 support is being looked at with AMD for Legion Go, nothing to share at the moment. Some gyro behavior improvement was included in 1.025 but still being worked on for future improvements. Some progress made on fan, coil, wine. We have internal support to start releasing some 3D files for device to help the third party solution creation. This is awesome. Again, it's pretty cool to see them thinking about these things. Now, I said this is a big one that a lot of people have been looking forward to. The VGA driver says that second, we are having some server issues again, the new driver release out. But Stacey, they gave us two options to where we can get these drivers. So I'll post this link in the description if you guys were interested. Definitely check this out. We're going to be showcasing this new drivers and to see if there's any performance improvement with this one. So stay tuned for that video. So over here, states issues we've looked into but are currently still unable to produce but still working on. Gathering more information, reports of high SSD temperature, reports of SD card stutter freezing on 2D games, reports of less speaker noise interference so again it's pretty cool to see them looking at this one all right legions that's all we have for you guys for this week let us know what your thoughts on this news in the comments below appreciate you guys we'll catch you guys in the next one till next time peace out